In the following video, I will show you how to answer question 7 of the June 2011 OCR Call 4 paper. Again, a question on solving differential equations. Let's take a look. It tells us that the gradient at the curve at the point x, y, uh, where x is bigger than minus 2, is given by the following. This is a differential equation because it's got a differential and the variables. It gives us that the points 1, 2 and Q1.5 lie in the curve find the value of Q to 1 dp. OK, the first thing we need to do is find the equation of the curve, i.e. find y. That involves solving the following differential equation. I'm going to do the method of separating variables and integration. Everything with y on the left-hand side, everything with x on the right-hand side. So, multiply everything by 3y squared multiply everything by dx and integrate and we get the following. We get the integral of 3y squared dy is equal to the integral of 1 over x plus 2 dx as our first line. Now we integrate this here, add 1 to the power and divide, we simply get y cubed and on the other side it's a ln x plus 2. We get a constant of integration on both sides, but I'm just going to write that as one combined constant, c. Now we know that the point 1, 2 lies on the line, so we can substitute in x is 1, y is 2. We would get 2 cubed, which is 8, is equal to ln 1 plus 2 is 3 plus c. So that tells us that c must be equal to 8 subtract ln 3. So our particular solution of this differential equation is therefore y cubed is equal to ln x plus 2 okay, plus 8 minus ln 3. It also tells us that q 1.5 lies on the curve and it wants us to find q. So we can sub in x equals q and y equals 3 over 2 or 1.5. So 3 over 2 cubed is 27 over 8 is equal to ln q plus 2 plus 8 minus ln 3. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to subtract 8 of both sides and add on ln 3. So we would get ln of q plus 2 is 27 over 8 subtract 8 and plus ln 3, so I would get ln 3 uh, minus 37 over 8. This is taking this and subtracting 8 and adding ln 3. OK, I should probably work out a number answer for this. So this is ln 3 um, minus 37 over 8. You get minus 3.52. Keep that in your calculator. Minus 3.526 dot dot dot. Don't... Uh, round it at this stage, that's equal to ln q plus 2. So to find q, take exponentials of both sides, so e to the minus 3.526, fully in your calculator, must equal uh, q plus 2. So rearranging q is this number, subtract 2. So e to the minus 3.526, subtract 2, And you get that Q is minus 1.97, uh, correct to 3 SF. So Q is equal to negative 1.97 to 3 significant figures. Okay, thank you for listening and watching this video. I hope you found it useful in your revision for call 4.